The wind is blowing so hard, I feel like the trees are gonna fall over. Hey vapors, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about Nectar Sour E-Liquid. <laughs> Yes, today we are looking at three flavors by Nectar Sour E-Liquid. Check out the cool box art. So they come in these boxes, super cute. Got three 30 mils in here. The 30 mils are $17.99 and 60 mils are $24.99. This e-liquid is available in 0, 3, and 6 milligrams nicotine and it is a 60 VG 40 PG blend. So let's just get to trying these flavors. We have apple, strawberry, and watermelon. These are sour apple, sour strawberry, and sour watermelon. I wanna go ahead and try the sour apple first because that sounds the yummiest to me. Here is the bottle art. It's similar for all of the flavors. Do a sniff test. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. This smells just like those thin, like straw sour candies that you can get like at the movie theaters. This smells like that if you liquefied it. I'm trying these flavors out today on my Troll RDA, but if you don't have an RDA or don't know how to use one and you want a flavor test without committing to an entire tank full of e-liquid, you can always invest in these 510 dripping atomizer barrels. They're super cheap and easy to use. You put a couple drops of the e-liquid down in there, put a drip tip on top, and you get a couple puffs of the flavor. I will leave a link below to these in the description box if you're interested in checking them out for yourself. But let's try a sour apple. Oh my gosh, I was right. Mmm. Okay, guys. Okay, one, this tastes exactly like if you took those sour candy straws, you know, the, like they're really thin, they're like this long probably, and you liquefied the sour apple kind and then you vaped it. That is what this tastes like. It's thick and syrupy and like gooey and sour and apple. Mm. Oops, angle change. Um, my Cool Fire TC100 died. <laughs> the battery is gone, so I had to pop this troll on my Cool Fire Ultra, which was previously set at 100 watts. <laughs> to kind of take that way down. Mm. The apple, it almost comes out a little bit more like a realistic apple flavor too at the end, like a crisp green apple. Next, I am trying the sour strawberry. Mmm. And it smells just like the other one, only strawberry. So it smells like that candy liquefied. Mmm. See, this one has like a fresh aspect to it as well. I'm getting really like a fresh strawberry on the exhale, like at the end. But when you're inhaling and everything, it's sweet, sugary, syrupy, like liquefied, gummy strawberry sour candy. Mmm. I, I like both of these flavors equally. I don't even know which one I would vape first. Mmm. Yum, yum. And last but not least, I am trying the sour watermelon. Now, if you've ever watched me taste a watermelon flavor, it's kind of, except for like watermelon bubblegum, like watermelon's such a light flavor that I feel like, I don't know, I don't know what this is gonna taste like, but like watermelon doesn't really have a flavor kinda to me. Like I just, it's not a strong flavor for sure. Like if I ever have a vape that's watermelon and something else, I can never really taste the watermelon over what else is in the vape. So let's smell this though. Yeah, I guess it does smell of watermelon, but I also get a lot of sour vibe from this smell. Like it just smells tart. Hmm. It's a very light watermelon flavor. But it, you do get that candy, liquid candy sour vibe as well. But this flavor is definitely a lot more toned down than the other two. It's just a light watermelony flavor. Like, I know it's supposed to be watermelon, but watermelon's such a light flavor that it's just like, kind of like, Reminds me of just like a fruit juice, but this one is specifically sour. Hmm. I think my favorite if I had to pick would be the apple one just because it tastes so much like those candies, like those sour shockers. I know someone knows exactly what I'm talking about. But if you've tried the Nectar Sour E-Liquid, let me know down in the comments below what you think of it. I will leave a link below to where you can check it out if you're interested for yourself. That's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to this channel for more videos. Don't forget to turn on the bell notification symbol down below so you don't miss a single video. I do tend 
and upload daily. And check the description box below for important links like where to get my favorite things like e-liquids, mods, etc. You can follow me on almost any social media site like Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat. All those social media links will be below. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please join Casa.org and fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia and thank you so much for watching.